Hello everyone and welcome to the Ratchet and Clank 3 beta. Here I have the lovely and talented Mike Stout. Hello, hello. Hello. So we can instantly see this is not a finished cutscene. Yeah, I mean all they have in these early cutscenes are like that block there which represents something that, you know, Clank touches say. Uh, or that remote control, you know, stuff that uh, was important for animating Ratchet and Clank in those scenes would be in here, but nothing else. Mm. Plus, it's super low res. I mean, you compare it to this video, right, which is super high res, and I mean, it looks better than pretty much any other cutscene in the whole game. Mm. And that's because this was the first one. They they did this cutscene uh, while everyone was still in pre-production, sort of. So it it got uh, it came out, and everyone loved it, and it was good times. Mm. I mean, it's, it is a very good cutscene. Yeah, I still love this cutscene. Mm. I do not know, Maximilian. I never lose. It's great because originally that was written as I don't know, uh, but Clank cannot use contractions, so it had to be changed. I see. This it's is one of the franchise rules. He can't use contractions. Right. Cannot use contractions. <laughs> Well, this is really great for me because I actually get to play Beta Mike. Beta Mike? Yes, I get to see your Beta stuff. Great. Yes, that's true. Well, wait, are any of my levels on this disc? Um, I guess we'll have to find Arcadia out. Arcadia exists, right? Arcadia, yeah, I, I, I did the, um, what's it called? The, the laser redirection puzzle. Yeah, so if Arcadia's on here, that'll be playable. That'll be it, yeah. These Tyranoids. Look amazing. The Kratos might be on. <laughs> that, that, <laughs> that white See, look, spin is amazing. Garlic Rats chat, two news, dude. <laughs> Did you see the microphone says two? It wasn't originally that in, uh, in Ratchet 1, but it got changed to channel 64 news. But, she was originally channel two, and I think they fixed it in this cutscene, but I don't know if it ended up being that way. Yeah, I'm not sure. Yeah. Is in the this is actually so cool. I, I love oh, that no. box. <laughs> the, the gravimetric warp, warp drive cylinder. That is the great. Gravimetric warp drive. The unfinished like gravimetric the warp drive. <laughs> I love it how he shoves it into the plane so we don't have to build or animate any mechanics inside the plane. Mm. Yeah. Just camera angle shove. This, uh, uh the, this is brilliant. Yeah, this ship will change texture every loading screen. Not surprising. I just hope we're not too late. So uh, we're going to everyone's favorite first planet of um, of Ratchet and Clank Free. Um, I'm pretty sure everyone loves this planet. Uh, who remembers Novalis? That's that's my favorite first planet of Ratchet Free. Yay, first planet from Ratchet Three, Novalis. Yeah, yeah. I, I don't even know if the planets had been named mostly, but we knew this one was Velden. So I'm not exactly sure why it is a planet that doesn't exist. Yeah, that is quite weird. But I, I find it amusing. So, but I mean, like, if you, uh, you know, if you if you turn on the cheats and uh, cheat yourself weapons, like, you'll notice that there are temporary textures in there. Like, yes. there were a lot of temporary assets that got put in for this game, knowing that they'd get replaced. So they looked wrong on purpose. Mm. Uh, I just want to show off in cheats um, the placeholder image there. It's a bunch of flowers, which is pretty amazing. Um, placeholder, yes. And in skill points, it's it's that. We need a two fifty six by two fifty texture here, Clank. So the guy who was our asset manager, Carl, he generally tried to make his placeholder images as horrible and ugly as possible, <laughs> so that so that when people saw them, they would say. Dear Lord, I have to replace that right now. Right, I see. Uh, that's that's the thing, man. If you if you put in temporary art and it's barely good enough, that thing is going to go out with the game. Right. Like because people aren't going to be annoyed enough by it to fix it. I see. Um, I'm just gonna mess around with this because I want the best of the best, uh, and I, I think you can understand where I'm coming from here. Um, let's see. I want that. Uh, yeah, I definitely want that and that and uh, yeah, that that can hurt. Uh, yeah, that'll I, I guess I'll do for now. Uh, you want to level it up all the way? God, yes. <laughs> okay, it's so the cool. first thing we'll just show off. 
there's yeah. way more menus. <laughs> way more. Yeah, um, it's there's a lot of things in this in this debug menu to talk about. Oh, what's the empty spaces? Are they? Uh, I think they're just there's no weapons in those slots. Well, they maybe. Uh, but go to go to Rhino three and push circle, and that'll. Mm. Yeah, then you get it all the way leveled up. Mm. It only goes to four. Uh, actually, that probably makes sense because that's how far. Zero goes. is level one, so yeah. it's one, two, three, four, five. Lava gun. Yep, I want liquid nitrogen. Oh, I can put it up to V eight. Sweet, rift inducer. Yes. <laughs> Uh, plasma coil. Yeah, I'll have some of that. Sure. Why? Why, why not? You know what? Why not? Why not? You know what? Why not? <laughs> mm. Excuse me for a minute. Oh, it's beautiful. <laughs> oh, yes. So. See, that's what the that's what the zodiac should have been, but we nerfed it too much. Yeah, the zodiac did very little, and by very little, I mean absolutely nothing. Uh, but hey, I I love the rhino in this game. It's a good Rhino, man. It is a great Rhino. It doesn't play, uh, what's it called? Ride of the Valkyries, but, it, you know, that's alright. Yeah, I mean, yeah, we, we have to compromise. It was pretty great, because, uh, they, they played, uh, Night on Bald Mountain, um, in, uh, Nexus. Uh, so, uh, Everyone decided to uh, call it Night on Teal Bald Mountain, um, and uh, they, yes. they edited my face on Chernobog from Fantasia. It was pretty great. It, it was, yeah, it was, it was pretty great. It was, it was a proud moment. I was hoping that uh, some some of the Quark vid comics might be on this disc. Oh, are they? Uh, yeah, and they might be in harder earlier states. Oh, but I'm not sure. Interesting. So, uh, you know, like we could we could test it out, but we're probably going to end up with a lot of crashes if we do that. Huh. So we might just need to edit it shorter once we get, you know, oh, the, yep, that crashed too. The, the liquid nitrogen gun is called the Firestorm. Is it? Yes. Does it still shoot liquid nitrogen? Uh, yes, it does. Huh, weird. Yeah, I guess that was a prototype name, even though there's yeah. no fire anymore. I'm glad to see you, Sarge. It seems like a lot of things hadn't been named yet on this build, which is pretty standard, uh, even for something this late. Mm, like, yeah, this is August, so this was what, four months before release. Yeah, three, four. Months. I mean, can you can you hear the, uh, the Rangers? Are they talking in their normal yeah, yeah, voices? Yeah, they're, they're, they're slowed down, but yes. Okay, but they're not just like total monotone voices like that. No, no, they're the, they're the same voices. Okay. So it's not super early. No, Still I mean, it's cause when did production of this game start? It was in between Ratchet 2, right? Uh, it started three months before the end of Ratchet 1 with a few people. Oh, right? wow. So, okay. Uh, when you get to the end of a project, you don't need, say, your designers as much anymore because you're not designing new stuff, right? Mostly you're fixing the stuff that's already there. Uh, so some, some designers usually will roll off onto whatever the, the next project is. And a few programmers, you know, some artists, they just sort of get started in terms of thinking about what the game is, making prototypes, that kind of stuff. And then uh, I rolled on to Ratchet 2 after taking a, a you know, two-week break. I think I started in like September of, of the same year. So before Ratchet 1 came out, right? Uh, what is we happening? <laughs> what have geez. I done to the game? <laughs> Oh, it's spawning infinite bolts. Oh my god. Oh my god, it's ne it's constantly dying. It's just it's upgrading me. experience too. Oh my god. What did you do? I don't know. Dude, get me to test your games. <laughs> I can find anything. Well, we clearly found this bug because it's not in release. Well, I guess, but oh Christ, it's so slow. Help me. I've got. I'm so rich. I s Run away from the bolts. Uh, we used to call this bug the golden shower. <laughs> yeah. That. Because it was a shower of gold. Yeah. And experience. And experience. Jesus Not always Christ. experience, but the that particular <laughs> bug, that particular bug came up a lot in the arenas for some reason. Ah, yeah. Well, I mean, if it's if it doesn't matter what enemy it is, it's probably just like a random thing, then yeah, it, there's a lot of enemies, it probably makes sense. More friends up here, but 
That was awesome. <laughs> That so far, great. this level's pretty much the same as it was, right? Yeah. Uh, this guy wasn't here, I don't think. Oh, so they might have made it a little easier. No! <laughs> no more! <laughs> you need to stop killing those guys, man. That is a golden shower. Mm. That is a lot of cash. I mean, that wasn't as bad as the first one you got. Yeah, because I didn't go away from it. Imagine doing it as ch challenge mode. <laughs> Just covered in gold, man. That, that would be... There are worse problems, I suppose. Um, so, is there anything you want to show off immediately? So, uh, probably not here in Velden. Yeah. I mean, except for the fact that, like, we're... If you turn back around and look, we're, we're at Ratchet's uh, workshop right now from yes. Ratchet 1. Yes. And, uh, yeah. And we use the same geometry, but sort of edited it a bit. Yeah, this is a little bit closer to where it was. Um, my friend, my friend Colin did this level, and he's great. He taught me pretty much everything I know uh, that I didn't learn from, you know, Algeyer or Cerny. Uh, and he did this level, and one of the things he really wanted was to sort of call back to the original, but not to have the same gameplay in, because, you know, that just felt like cheating. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. I mean, it is very different. Uh, Veldin has advanced in a couple of years that Ratch has been away. Yeah, maybe Ratchet was the one bringing it down. Yeah, clearly. It is clearly it not Ratchet's got, fault. It might have gotten a lot of publicity from Drek trying to blow it up and Ratchet saving it. Possibly. Everybody but Ratchet seems to reap the rewards of Ratchet's ability to save the galaxy. Yeah, he just seems to get in more trouble each time. But that's what we love about Ratchet. Yeah. Get back in there, trooper. We've got a planet to save. I don't know if I prefer drunk James Arnold Taylor or drunk whoever voiced Ratchet in Ratchet 1. Because drunk Ratchet in Ratchet 1 was pretty great. Mikey Kelly? Ah, yes, that's the one. Yeah, he, he was pretty great. Oh, I do want to show this off, actually, because this is kind of interesting. Um, go for it. I'm going to get some water real quick. Okay, so uh, if I go on to camera controls uh, and I move myself say, over here, be like, oh, I want to finish the level, let's do it over here, nice. that, that's a good idea, right? Uh, no, it actually puts me back in here, because uh, I'm in a separate state, which is pretty cool. Um, because, yeah, I guess the, it's locked me in this sort of area, but that's alright, I, I, I don't need to, I don't need to do that, because I've got a rhino, it's fine, everything it's will of, die. It's sort of like, remember in, um, Ratchet 1 when I was mentioning state changes and how a lot of bugs with hollow guys and stuff would come in because you change to a different hero state, Ratchet would be doing something else, but then you you cheat out of it sort of by putting on the hollow guys. That's basically what you just did. And then the programmer said, nah, I'm not gonna let you. Fair enough. Uh, apparently people have made up a drifting game. Anytime I say fair enough, they must take a shot. I say it a lot <laughs> apparently. <laughs> You know what? That's fair enough. It, it is. It is fair enough. I'm. I'm learning. Fair enough. Fair so enough. I, you know, fair I just. I, I'm learning things. I. I will say fair enough to that. That. That's. That is fair enough. This. This build or this video might. Uh, might end up killing some people if they play that drinking game. So I would advise that they don't play that drinking game with this video. Yeah. No, I wouldn't. Uh, I remember when I did like a little bit of work experience. My my first ever work experience job. There was a. Uh, there was this guy, we, we, we worked at a place where we set up conferences, and this guy um, like, was talking about how his, the, he went to a wine tasting thing. Um, but I think his, his girlfriend or wife at the time um, like, set up for him. Um, and, and there was this Russian guy who was there, and he was just like, he was just like can we bring our own drinks? Like, um, we're gonna, we, we might be able to share something in one of the final weeks, but for now we're just gonna have a... Have our own, have our own wine um, that we've we've supplied for you. It's like, no, I bring my own vodka, ninety six percent. Like Jesus, that's 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 very strong. <laughs> that's Fair enough. That is. Oh, what did I do? What what was the what was the light display? Did you kill something? No, the enemy's still there. Golden shower, maybe. Who knows? No, no golden shower. Sadness. Oh well, we beat the level. That's all that matters. It's good times. Sir, we have a transmission from the president. 
that is finished. Oh yeah, ship it. Is is that secret agent? That effect was hard to do, man. I mean, uh, the character on screen like that. Is Clank's head attached to his neck properly? Seems a bit loose. Let me see. No, no, no. Hold on a second. He looks so drunk when he's when it's slowed down. As you may know, only one man has ever faced him and survived. I've just received a top secret report on that man's world. This president, of course, Here, modeled vocally after Bill Clinton. Mm. On tonight's episode of Nature's Mysteries, we examine the Florana tree. Okay, so the music for this cutscene isn't there. The dense growth yeah. of Florana's Jambu Forest. I wonder if this whole cutscene is the same. This one got changed late. He doesn't. It's one of nature's mysteries. We'll see. I've seen him run right through our camping site. He was Oh wait, no, not this one. Screaming and holding a banana. Or, or maybe it weren't a banana. It could be one of nature's mysteries. Legend tells. Yeah, it doesn't no, seem I was thinking of the creature. I was thinking of the behind the hero one about Captain Cork where he uh, escapes from prison. Ah, uh, that's right, too. Recent past. He is now. Is it? Okay. One of nature's mysteries. Yeah, that is about Isn't it? And find out the answer. What's the what's isn't there one in here where they talk about like Captain Quark and I need you to find uh -huh. this man. The fate of the galaxy may depend on it. Are you sure this is There were a few jokes we had to take out of the cutscenes in this game to get it to oh, the really? you know the right rating, yeah. And yet you managed to keep in he could be holding his and then cutting out dick and Clank literally just, saying what a load of bullshit and then getting it cut. How the I hell did you get away with that? I was astonished that those things weren't also called out. Yeah, all of us were, but you know. That is amazing. Yeah, that was amazing. It is a miracle that wasn't cut. Like, genuinely. Yeah, I mean, a bunch of stuff had to get changed, like, um, uh, Quark, uh, yeah, I thought that was in this game, but I guess not. Like, I remember once we had to, for the ESRB, change a joke where Quark chiseled his way out of jail with his butt. <laughs> his finely oh, chiseled man. buttocks, I think, was what we called it. Oh, that is fantastic. Wow. Wow, that is great.